Be honest. How many times have you given up on making a video because it felt too complicated? Cameras, editing, hours of work, and still not the result you wanted. Now imagine this. You type a script, pick an avatar, and in minutes, you have a studio-quality video, even translated into five languages with one click. That's the power of HeyGen. Welcome to NextGen AI Lab, where I show you the smartest AI tools to save time, crush limitations, and create like a pro. Let's get started. Let's start from the Hen homepage. Click Create Video to begin. For a faster start, you can choose a template from the Hen library. In this example, we're using a learning and development template. Ever struggled with topic in your work? Annie. Once you select your template, you'll land inside the editing studio. Here's the layout. There are four main sections. The script panel, the canvas, the toolbar, and the scene timeline. Let's walk through each one quickly. The script panel is where your story begins. Type directly into the panel, upload an audio file, or record your voice inside. Hey Jen, once your script is in click preview to hear it back, you can highlight any word to adjust pronunciation or click the pause icon to add natural breaks. Want to change the voice? Click it to explore different languages, accents, and speeds. Pro tip, you can also translate your script right inside the panel. No need to leave the editor. Next up, the canvas. This is your creative space where everything comes together visually. Every script needs a speaker, so start by adding an avatar. You can select a custom avatar from your library or browse HeyGen's collection of 700 plus diverse public avatars. Once added, adjust the framing to fit your scene just right. Now let's talk about the toolbar. Here you can bring your video to life by adding text overlays, media like images, videos, and music, elements like shapes, stickers, and icons, or even captions for accessibility. Each asset can be animated. Use the animation markers in the script panel to control when it enters and exits the scene. Want to connect your scenes with a bit of polish? Just hover between them in the timeline and add a transition, like a slide, fade, or flow. When you're ready, hit Preview at the top. If everything looks good, click Generate. And just like that, your video is on its way. And that's your first look at the new Hayden Studio. We'll go deeper into each of these tools. First things first, you'll need to be inside the HeyGenon AI Studio. Uh, once you're in, click the avatars button up in the toolbar. See those familiar faces at the top? Yep, that's where all your custom avatars live. Want to make a new one? Just hit Create New Avatar. Or you can choose from Hen's stock library of over 700 diverse public avatars ready to go you'll probably find the perfect match in no time. For this example, I'm going with one of my favorites. Annie notice how most avatars come with a few outfit changes, different poses or backgrounds. Um, let's add a new scene and give Annie a fresh look. Now let's talk framing real quick. Think of this like picking your favorite profile photo. You can go with standard zoomed in close up or even that trendy circular frame. Totally up to you. Choose what fits your scene best. Oh, and one last tip. Removing the background of any public avatar is ridiculously easy. Just flip the toggle and boom background, gone. Perfect for making your avatar not blend into any scene. You can do this for custom avatars too. If you have a creator, teams or enterprise plan, with Hen. Make sure you enable background removal when creating them. And that's it. You're now officially an Avatar Pro inside. Click background. You can choose from solid colors, stock images, or video clips. Want more control? Select detach from background to freely move or resize your visual elements. 
You can also set a background directly from the Media tab. Just pick an uploaded asset or a stock image. Right-click it and choose Set as Background. Need to add some text? Click text at the top of the canvas to drop in titles, labels, or other on-screen elements. Customize the font, size, formatting, opacity, and alignment. Or upload your own brand font to keep everything on brand. Drag to reposition or resize your text anywhere on the canvas. Want more control? You can highlight multiple elements to align and group them. Perfect for staying organized as you design. To bring in media, open the Media tab to upload your own files or browse high-quality stock from Pexels and Getty Images. Just drag and drop assets right into your scene. Looking to add a little extra personality? Head over to the Elements tab to add shapes, frames, stickers, or icons. If you're uploading your own media, go to My Library and hit Upload Now. Let's say you're starting with a simple scene, maybe just your avatar and some text. But to really showcase your message, you want to add a bit of movement and visual interest. That's where animations come in. With just a few clicks, you can control how elements appear, move, and exit your video. To get started, select any elements on the canvas, like text, an image, or your avatar. This will reveal animation markers in the script panel. These markers let you time exactly when the element should appear or disappear. Just drag them to the right point in your script to sync your visuals with your message. Then, choose how the element enters or exits. You can go for a simple fade, a zoom in or out, a slide in from any direction, or even a pop-in effect. Once selected, you can adjust the duration to make the movement feel faster or slower. Need a preview? Just hover over each animation style to see how it looks before applying it. Applying it Hey, now. welcome back to- Let's talk scene transitions. The connectors between each part of your video. They help guide your viewer smoothly from one scene to the next, making your video feel cohesive and intentional. To add a transition, hover over the space between two scenes in the timeline. From there, choose from options like crossfade for a smooth blend, slide for directional movement, or flow for something more dynamic. Once you've picked a style, you can fine-tune it by adjusting the duration and direction. And if you want a consistent feel across your entire video, click Apply to All Scenes. For best results, make sure your scenes are visually distinct so the transition feels natural and clear. Let's get started. Templates are the fastest way to get started in HeyGen, whether you're creating ads, explainer videos, or training modules. There's a ready-made template waiting for you. From the home page, click Create Video, and then choose Use a template to start a new project. Already working on a video? No problem. You can still add a template slide right from the script panel or the timeline. Just click the plus scene button, then select Add from Template. HeyGen automatically shows templates that match your current aspect ratio. You can browse by use case to find something that fits your project's tone and purpose. If you've created custom templates, they'll show up under My Templates. Want a closer look? Just hover to preview the animations and click to see all the slides included in a template. Once you've found the one you like, click Add Scene to drop it into your video. From there, you can customize the template to match your brand. Change the colors, update the fonts, move elements around, or add your custom avatar. To create your own template, go back to the home page, head to the Templates section, and click Create Template. Once saved, it'll appear in My Templates and be ready for use in future projects. Just finished creating a new video in HeyGenon and want to translate it? No problem. Once your video is generated, head to its share page and click Translate. From there, choose up to five target languages to translate the spoken script. Make sure to check the box that says Translate Script. Want to include on-screen text as well? 
just click the Translate Text on Canvas button to translate all visible text in your scene. When you're ready, click Translate. HeyGen will automatically create a new draft for each language, keeping the exact scenes and layout from your original video. Want to create a multi-language video in HeyGen? Here's how. Use a separate scene for each language you want to include. In each scene, you can either write your script in the target language or translate it from the original. To translate a single scene, click the three-dot menu in the script panel. Select Translate. Pick your target language and hit Apply. Need to make edits? No problem. Just tweak the translated script directly in the panel. Repeat this process for each language and your multi-language video will be ready to go. Here's a quick best practice. When using a voice to speak another language, it's generally best to keep the original accent of the voice, unless your message calls for a specific change. Most voice providers support a variety of languages while maintaining the tone and character of the original voice. But if accent accuracy matters, Test a few voices and accents to find the best fit. To translate an external video, start from your Hagen and homepage. Click Create Video, then choose Translate a Video. Paste in a YouTube or Google Drive link or upload your video file. Click Next. Hagen will automatically detect the original language. You can select up to five target languages. Need more control? Click the Advanced tab. Here you can select the number of speakers, upload a transcript, turn lip sync on or off, remove background sound, and more. We also recommend keeping dynamic duration turned on. This automatically adjusts your video timing to match the translated script, so if the new version is slightly longer or shorter, it still flows naturally. If this helped level up your video skills, hit subscribe and let's keep creating smarter with AI.